my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, why is faith important? Our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ told his disciples when they asked why they could not cast out a demon from a demon-possessed boy, that they had a lack of faith. He went on to say, Assuredly, I say to you, if you have faith as a mustard seed, you will say to this mountain, Move from here to there, and it will move, and nothing will be impossible for you. He goes on to say that this kind can only be removed through prayer and fasting. So faith is necessary to move mountains. But what are mountains? If we study this event, we see that the boy who was brought to Jesus Christ is afflicted by a terrible demon. And the demon tries to throw him into the fire and into the water to destroy him. The fire represents the passions in this life that conflagrate and try to take over us, whether it is any of the seven deadly sins or any passion that consumes us. The water represents the anxieties of this world, threatening to drown us as we all often feel we just can't get enough air. We feel like we're drowning with all of our cares and worries. Jesus Christ tells us that if we have faith the size of a mustard seed, just a little thing, we can take these insurmountable things, the passions and our anxieties, and we can move them with just a little bit of faith. By telling us that these sort of demons can only be removed through prayer and fasting, he gives us the tools on how to develop that faith. Through prayer and fasting, we can learn to control the fire inside of us, so that instead of it being something that is going to rage out of control and destroy us, it can be something measured and energized. And conversely, if we learn to pray and fast and have faith, then just as Jesus Christ told Peter to walk on the water like him, we too can walk on top of the water of our anxieties. No longer will we drown in them, but we will be able to walk on top of them with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ, let us nurture and culture our faith so that we can move the mountains that are in our way, whether it is the mountain of our passions or the mountain of of our anxieties. If we have just a little bit of faith, we can tell that anxiety, we can tell that passion to move, and it will move to the health and love and care of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit.